So there's two types of numbers. We can have real or imaginary. And real numbers can be broken up into rational numbers, or they might be irrational numbers. But what's the difference? Ah, that, my friends, is what we will look at shortly. But rational numbers can be broken down even further, I know, exciting, into the integers. But we can actually break those down even further into... Whole numbers, yeah, we'll work on, you were close, you, you almost had that one. And then finally we can break whole numbers up into... No, if it can be a fraction, then it is rational. Square root 4, 3, 21. 13 fifths and negative 12. 10, 6, square root 49. They are all rational. 3 fifths, 4 ninths, 1 half, 9 six. Negative 4, 26. Square root of 196. They are all rational. 1,308. Negative 304. 200 all over 5. They are all rational. 1.30914. 6.15 repeating. Negative 0.145. They are all rational. Integers are a type belonging to rationals. Positives, negatives. Even zero is one, two. One step down are whole numbers. No negatives involved. The third kind are called counting. They may also go by natural, natural, natural. Start with one and count them, count them, count them. They are the naturals. One and two and three and four, five, six, seven and eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Let's do some whole numbers. Zero and magnitude, twenty-five and one hundred, forty-one and thirty-two. How about some integers? Five hundred and seventy-four, negative seventy-one, zero and forty-four. They are so rational, rational, rational. They are all rational. The other kind of real 
here.